Hey Norwegian Cruise fans and welcome to my channel Cruise with Grant where we talk about all things Norwegian Cruise Lines. Now if you've watched any of my videos before you'll know I'm all about the food when it comes to cruising and today I'm going to share with you my top tips and hacks to eat off of Norwegian's secret menu. And if you stick around to the end, I'll share with you a few of my favorite secret menu items. So without further ado, let's get into it. Now my first tip for eating on the secret menu applies to eating in the main dining room. Think about the meals that you've already enjoyed on your cruise or maybe things that you didn't try and the items that they included. Oftentimes later in your cruise, if you ask for one of those items, you can have it as part of your meal. The example that I'll use is the chocolate lava cake that served for dessert once or twice during the cruise. It comes with this absolutely delicious stracciatella gelato. So while others are ordering off of the regular dessert menu, I'll often ask if they can bring me a cup of that stracciatella gelato and it's absolutely delish. My second tip for eating off of the secret menu applies to dining in the specialty dining restaurant like Le Bistro, Moderno, and Cagney's. Now oftentimes you'll find on many of the NCL ships that the kitchens from these restaurants are very close together if not the same. And so that means that if you're hankering for something at one of the restaurants with the shared kitchen, you may be able to ask for one of those items very kindly um, to substitute for something that's on the regular menu. For example, I'm absolutely in love with the coconut tres leches cake at Moderno. So sometimes when I'm eating at Cagney's that usually has a shared kitchen, I'll ask to see if I can get a piece of that cake with my dessert instead of getting one of the regular desserts at Cagney's. Okay, so you might be thinking, Grant, this isn't really a secret menu. This is just a way of getting items I've already seen in other places. And you're right. But this last tip is about ordering items that you're only going to find if you ask for them. And a great example of this is the cheese plate in the main dining rooms. Now the cheese plate comes with a wide selection of different cheeses, some dried fruits and nuts, um, and it's available on request in the main dining room, but you have to know to ask for it. I also sometimes want to have a little bit of a healthier option when I'm eating my meal, and I often ask for steamed vegetables as a substitute for potatoes or rice along with my proteins. Again, you're not going to see that showing up on the menu, but you can always ask for it when you're dining as a substitution or just as an add-on to your meal. Thanks for sticking around. I'm going to share with you my top picks for secret items that I like to order when I'm on a cruise. And the first one is the French press coffee. And this applies to where you have a Cagney's, Le Bistro, or Moderno that are close together or have a shared kitchen. Now, don't get me wrong, the coffee on board NCL in general is all right, but the French press coffee is absolutely amazing. Normally, you can get this coffee from Le Bistro, but I found if I ask very nicely, they will arrange to have the French press brought up to me if I'm eating in Cagney's or Moderno. The second thing that is one of my favorites on the secret menu is at Oceans or The Local. Now, when you're going during breakfast hours, one of the things that's not widely advertised is fresh squeezed orange juice. And you can get this only during the breakfast hours. They will charge you if you don't have a drinks package. I think it's about after 11 o'clock. But if you go in the morning and you're enjoying your breakfast or you just want some fresh squeezed orange juice, you can ask them. Uh, and again, find that gem that's not usually found on the menu. Are there any secret menu items that you've discovered on your cruises with Norwegian? Please share those in the comments below. And don't forget to check out my other video on top dining mistakes to avoid when you're cruising on Norwegian. If you found this video helpful, please remember to give it a like and consider subscribing to the channel as it really does help me out. I hope everyone's having a great day and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.